Hello, it's Guru Rizabay here, and I'm back with another skin to make. So today, as you can see over here, we're going to be making Hiccup's outfit onto my grizzly bear, as usual. If you don't know who Hiccup it is, he is from How to Train Your Dragon. He is awesome. I just may have finished season four of the How to Train Your Dragon Netflix series. <laughs> you know, not addicted at all. It just I just started watching yesterday, and I finished it today. Uh, you know. <laughs> so anyways, I figured we'd get right into it. It seems like a pretty simple one. For the most part, nothing will be done on the head. But right off the bat, he's kind of just got a dark brown. Not dark brown. This is a, light, a little bit lighter brown. Let's go with that type of brown. There we go. So we are going to... We'll start with the legs. Which we actually want to mirror for a minute. There we go. Whoopsie. Get back to the top. I find the front again. Alright. So take off the mirror. Because now what we gotta do is his this leg is actually cut off was cut off or got cut off. I, I don't remember how, like I think it was blown off by a dragon. So what we gotta do is do the same here, so We'll do it on the bottom three, I think. That should be enough room, hopefully. Just completely start out with a blank slate at the bottom. Okay, apparently you can't just click to make everything erase on that side. Make sure I have the front still. Alright, so the way it's made this looks pretty simple. Maybe I should go up one more. I'm gonna go up one more just to make sure we have enough space. Because what I'm gonna do, I'll make sure my head stays on. So I'm gonna get a silver color. Something, because it's a light, a very bright silver. So obviously he has his little wooden peg piece. There we go. And then we gotta get, we'll get a little bit darker wood. A little bit darker for the wood of the leg. Actually, it's a little bit lighter than what he has. Almost like a cherry like that. There we go. So do this. Go all the way around. And then we'll do one more loop of the silver. But then, with how it is on the back, it comes down like this. Except I don't want to make it come up one. Let me make grid go away for a second. No, that didn't do nothing. Okay. Um, here, let's actually do that slightly differently. So we're gonna leave that part on, but we're now we're gonna make it go into a little peg leg part just like this. And then come up one. See how it comes up? There you go. Let's actually also make this silver instead. Whoops. And change this to a light brown. There we go. I'm just kind of moving the whole system up one. It does make it so it will be a little bit closer to where his knee is, or where my person knee is, but that should be alright. Whoops, just as long as we get the point across that it is his kind of peg leg. And with how it has it, so we want to keep the gray, but just go slightly darker, because every other one will make it a slightly darker color to act like the little round spots that it has down here and not up top at all. Hey! I got it in the wrong spot. Okay, there we go. And just go around it to make it look like it has those little pieces on it. There we go, look at that. Perfect. 
All right. All right, and then let's bring back his other leg real quick, which has a darker brown. All the browns are there's so many much brown with this. It's quite it's quite a bit darker actually. So let me actually see how tall this is because we want to go about the same height with his boot. There we go. He's got very tall boots. But that is okay. It's actually pretty tall on him too. I guess. Maybe it's a little bit shorter, but not by much. There you go. There she is. Okay. Actually, yeah, his knee, I think, is like. His knee is either right here, or right. I'm pretty sure his knee is kind of like right here. No, it's not that short. His knee must be right there. So what we also want to do then with the darker, because now we want to mirror this, is about here. And he has a couple of those straps going around. So we'll do that strap there. And then it kind of comes down here just a little bit. Hmm. <laughs> so that should also have one. Looks good. Alright, so then, except it's not that much, it's actually lighter. So let's actually make it like this color. It seems like a lot of his leather is a lot lighter. Alright, and then let's get rid of the leg for a minute. And bring it back the, the body. So it actually, the shirt kind of comes up more like this. There we go. If you can see, it comes up up like that. So we'll do that. I think that's only on the back or on the front. I think the rest of it actually stays relatively, pretty much covering him. Cause like this side actually winds up coming down a little bit. There we go. Uh, we'll make it. Whoops. We'll make it come up a little bit, just not quite as much. There you go. Because his back has to be covered by the leather as well. There you go. Just get it slowly kind of filled in. There you go. Maybe it's not quite that type of brown. That's a little better, actually. Actually, let me do this right now so that way we get that color differential because you can see is it looks kind of like scales on his that was a close one boop, 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 boop. there we go there we go and then let's bring it up around here a bit There we go. Kind of looks like scaling a little bit. I didn't want to try and go one by one. That would be really difficult. All right. Wow. It so it looks like he actually has a green undershirt. Here, let me. So let me see how this parts look together right now. It's not looking too bad. Not too bad at all. Whoops. So let's take this off. Nope, undo that one. Or right, here, let me go like this. And fix that up real quick. There we go. That's better. Alrighty. Okay, so far so good. We get a slightly lighter brown and kind of do a little bit of crisscrossing here. Take off the mirror while I do that, or else it's going to copy on over. Crisscross, crisscross, crisscross.
There we go. There we go, just like that. We'll do it that way. There we go. Alright, so now he has the little straps. That's what they're called. Call them straps. Okay, so let's finish his chest. Let's continue with his chest. But with this chest, it needs to have that overlay. Because what we're going to do now is that his chest is like... So he has a belt, like down here. Belt a couple more up. And then like here up, it's actually a suit. Or armor. It's called armor, you know. As I call it, a suit. I'm kind of ridiculous sometimes. I don't know the words I speak at times, you know, because why not? So have you guys watched How to Train Your Dragon? It's a great, it's a great show. It's a great movie. I really like it. I kind of want to see the movies again. The second one was sad. I won't spoil anything. I really want to, but I won't. I, I love the show as well. The show is really good, and I'm finally happy that some pieces are happening. Once again, I won't spoil it, especially considering it literally just came out. Okay, there we go. And he has a nice, well, let me do a little bit of this because his armor is not going to be perfect. There's no way. He's been in too many battles for it to be perfect. There we go. Oh, and then I still got to get the top part up over his shoulders like this. Just like that. Whoops. Boop, boop. There we go. There you go, and then let's do his, well, actually I like his belts like that. Actually no, you can see the old, how much stuff he has on it, so you can't just leave it plain. So never mind on that original plan. There you go. So I gotta get rid of that. There we go. Okay, let's double check where the front is. There's the front. Alright, let's bring out the arms. Whoops, I have not finished the arms. And let's mirror this real quick. Whoops. <laughs> uh, there we go. There you go. Actually, undo that bottom part. Whoops. There we go. Everything looks pretty good. Where's the front? I don't know how I keep landing on the front. And then he actually has more of a greenish undershirt. Like, not a lime green, it's a very dark green. I don't know how well you can see that, so... I should have actually done this as a green then. Let's fix that right now. There we go. Let me get like this brown and just bring my arms back up a little bit. There you go. There we go. Alright, so and then his shoulders need to be whoops. There we go. Alright, so we have the green undershirt. Now let's bring back the tops. Okay, so let's get... How did... Where did that come in? Oh, that's the over top. So... I do that. And... Whoops. So, do this. Whoops. Damn it. Having a couple struggles right now, obviously. Alright, now I can do this. There we go. Now no more issues. Just having that random piece floating there. Jeez. There we go, that's better. 
All right, so there's the head. And then I want to make this piece up over the top. And obviously he has that on both. So it's like, how are those back here again? Oh, because I took, let me erase that real quick. No, eraser. No, stop it. Just click all this away real quick. There we go. Seems like that's all of it. Alright. Now we can do this. Where it comes down. Kind of pointed like that. And then it has black that goes up and around. Up not like that but like this up to about there looks like he oh that's where he holds his knife smart smart that seems like an easy way to be able to grab your knife instead of having to go all the way around make sure this is being mirrored perfect Ben is not and then he has just like that. There we go. I'm not going to put the knife in there just to, so it holds over. Actually. Whoops. Whoops. Can't go back. There we go. Do that. I only do it by two this time because it doesn't quite touch. Alright, and then go up with a little bit darker brown than what this is and go up by like two there we go and then get the black with this again is then right over the top of it will be this da da da, -da. armor there we go. Make sure that connects. Yes, it does. There we go. Look at that. We're getting there. We're getting there. Very highly detailed piece. A little bit more detailed than what I'll probably be able to do, but that is o a okay. Let's make sure he has his little belt links. And then he has one kind of going up around here. And then there's a piece of, there's a spot that's nice and red. Just like that. Which is right here. And then he also has that on his shoulder, so let's take away that mirror. Yes, it's pretty decent size. There we go. Okay, okay. Looking kind of nifty. I think that's pretty much what his armor really looks like. Maybe pick up this brown. Go a little tad bit darker. 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 Um, let me take this off real quick. And mirror. And then just give this a little bit of detail. Okay, a little bit darker because I somehow wound up with the exact same color. There we go. There we go. Just add a little bit of detail in here. Whoops. There we go. Pants. Okay, it was just to give it a little bit more detail to it. Okay. Then you got his armor. I don't know why his armor comes up so high. Oh, actually, a bit of it comes down a bit. Okay, so let's get you. So you need to come down a bit more like that. Perfect. There we go. Alright, and then 
I do want to try and see if I can manage the helmet. Alright, so that's my head. Okay, so obviously I have to go around the ears. It's kind of a given. Okay. Then I think it's black all the way down the back. And most of the side, like that probably. So let me fill this little portion in. <laughs> Looks like I have weird hair. Okay, so it went back by two. One, two. Down one. And back. Back two? Or down two? Back two. And one. 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 There we go, just like that. I wish once you ha had a section pieced off, then you could just fill in the one section, but you can't exactly do that. Alright, and then in the face, it comes down like this, and around like this. There we go. And then after that, it has a nice dark brown, which will come up to about there. Let's take this off real quick. And then this comes down like this. There we go. Kind of swoops up and around a little bit. So my dude will even have his Viking mask. I don't know what made him decide to go with that mask. It's, it's cool. It's definitely a cool mask. I just, I'm curious as to what made him decide that one. Or what that would be his pattern. Like, I wonder. There you go. Looking pretty good. Alright. I think we pretty much got it. Yeah, I I'd say we pretty much have his uniform pretty well derped out. Sweet! And then, obviously, we have his peg foot. Gotta have that. So, awesome. We got them all set. We got them made, man! We got a dragon rider! We can ride the Night Fury! Toothless, where are you? Well, guys, uh, thank you all for watching. Um, like and subscribe below. Go check out my other skins that I've made. And suggest other ideas for skins, and I'll see you later. Bye bye